Welcome to the Makerspace in the Lou Family Secondary School for the report on the concluding term of 2017. Another action-packed and busy time. Chagiga 2017 was a fantastic night of celebration with the theme of yesterday, today and tomorrow. It featured performances, awards, valedictory addresses of last year's captains and the VCE art exhibition. Year 7 to 10 students took part in our first ever day dedicated to Advance Australia Fair, designed to both celebrate and investigate what it means to be Australian. Students came dressed in green and gold and spent time understanding the themes of the national anthem, including what makes Australia unique, multiculturalism and Australian political ideologies. At a special assembly, Old Collegian Dr Howard Goldenberg gave a moving address on what being Australian means to him and his family and how he contributes to Australian society. The Shilluv Conference for Year 11 featured international speakers Rabbi Yoni Rosenweig and Giddy Greenstein, big picture long-term Jewish and Israeli leader, as well as many local presenters. The conference encourages students to think, learn and act through a Jewish lens so that their Jewish identity informs their choices and actions as citizens of Australia and the world. House plays involved over 100 students from years 7 to 9, focusing on creativity, teamwork and school spirit. Year 9 student leaders directed, produced, acted as musical directors and choreographers to design original pieces of theatre, dance and live music. Mazel tov to the overall winner, Hillel House. The Year 5 Manuel Gelman Public Speaking Evening saw many excellent speeches by our students. Congratulations to all participants and to the winners. In secondary sport, congratulations to our premiers. Girls Hockey, Boys Volleyball B and Indoor Soccer A and B. Congratulations to Hillel for winning the House Shield for the fourth consecutive year. Congratulations again to Hillel House on the seventh consecutive win in the Primary Athletics Carnival. Term 4 has seen a number of camps for Year 4, for Year 5, for Year 7 in Apollo Bay, for Year 8 in the Grampians. These camps take students outside their comfort zone and develop important teamwork and resilience skills as well as being lots of fun. The Year 9 Outdoor Ed Camp in the Brisbane Ranges National Park in Western Victoria saw the culmination of this popular elective subject. We said farewell to Year 12 of 2017 at the Graduation Ball, enjoyed by students, staff and families. A fitting conclusion to their Scopus career. In October, a group of students from Year 7 and 8 joined over 3,000 Victoria school students and dignitaries at a special commemoration ceremony for the centenary of the Battle of Beersheba at the Shrine of Remembrance. Students laid a wreath on behalf of Mount Scopus College and heard a thoughtful and informative address by the Governor of Victoria. Very many of our Year 10 students are currently here in Israel on our wonderful All Pun program, including 17 students who've been here for an extended period, living and learning in Hebrew. This year All Pun offers students more choice than ever before, with three-day options where students choose from a Shavil hike in the Negev, camping in the Arava, and volunteering in a kindergarten or a new social justice program in Haifa. In preparation for the Shabbat project, our kinders and junior campuses enjoyed baking challah together with their parents and grandparents. The Helen Sinman Archive opened its doors to the school community for the inaugural Archive Roadshow. Exhibits were visited by students, alumni, grandparents and friends, staff and volunteers, and the collections on display revealed the rich history of the college. Thank you to all the volunteers who do such a wonderful job in preserving and cataloguing and displaying our archives. As part of the community's commemoration of Mitzvah Day, our GBH and FKI children sang for aged care residents at a number of venues, and our kinders baked challah for sea care and made muesli for pekalach. Secondary students volunteered with Stand Up and were able to connect with the Sudanese community through arts and crafts and playing and chatting with the children in their care. And finally, we wish all students, parents, staff, the entire Scopus community a joyous and meaningful Hanukkah, a good break, and we look forward to seeing you back next year refreshed and ready to go for 2018.